everybody and welcome back to my Life is Strange 2 episode 3 Let's Play. Let's continue, shall we? This is so messed up. I told Daniel. Fucking Finn. Hey, get mad later. We got shit to do now. If something happens, fuck me. It's okay. We're gonna get them. Bring them back. Thanks for coming with me, Cassidy. Don't thank me. I'm gonna kill Finn myself. Well, that was fun while it lasted. <laughs> Somebody now... build the lock. <sighs> of course. We probably gotta check a car. Now back to the serious stuff. One truck is missing. See? Those tracks are headed out. Fuck. At least they didn't wake Big Joe up. But if we do, he'll kill us, Sean. So let's not advertise. No lights, no noise. I'll check the car, you do the truck. Check the other door now. Maybe the car then? Cass, check it out. So, all the doors are locked, but we just gotta get into one car. And I think I can get that truck started. You shitting me? My dad was a mechanic. He once showed me how to hotwire his tow truck, just in case. Sean Diaz, you're full of surprises. Plus, we could, uh, mess with all the other cars so Big Joe can't follow us. Love the way you think. We can find some things here to bust shit up. But we can't make a sound. Sean. Check the car. All doors locked. Of course. Keep looking around. We need to find a way to open that trunk. Forget it. Anything else I can take from there? No? Just that? Okay. Can I do this quietly? This fits in one of the cars. There she blows. Just for equal measure. Damn, that was fun. Not gonna follow us now, motherfucker. Be 
enough. Yeah, well, honestly, one would have been enough, but yeah, that'll do. Come on. Quiet. Just gotta get in that truck and start her up. Gonna need something quiet, because if we stop, if we smash the window open, that's gonna create noise. So I'm gonna need something quiet. Search. Of course. Score. see anything else here that we can use, so back out. <laughs> Fuck. Guess we won't be working here anymore. Finn is so fucking stupid. Man, focus. We have to get into that truck. Here goes. This is going to create noise. Two. Shit. He's fucking coming. Let's go. <sighs> fuck, fuck, fuck. What the hell? He'll be on us in any second now. Yes, I know. There was no other option, though. Sean, you did it. Let's get out of here. Man. Drive. Fuck this shit. We did it. But it was so close. Let's do this. I don't like this shit at all. Yeah. I just want to get this over with. Don't say that. Things can't go wrong after the night we've had. This is basic karma. Shit, right? I want this to continue, Cass. We should go. They might not even be inside yet. Oh, Finn is out of control. Has he done this before? Fuck us over? Not like this. Why now? Because Finn thinks Daniel is his golden ticket. He just gets greedy and stupid. We gotta catch him. Sean, we find together. Promise. How? What's Meryl gonna do if he catches them? Finn's a smart old shitter. He'll find a way out of this. I know. Oh shit, the CCTV. Good. At least Meryl won't know anyone's coming. Okay. Okay, that's good. Ah, oh, shit. You scared the shit out of me. Good. What the fuck are you doing? Didn't we settle this, man? Shh. You're gonna wake Meryl. Finn, no fucking way. Come on, Sean. Are you kidding me? How could you do that, Finn? And you're some fucking kid. He's nine years old. He asked me for it. I didn't force him, man. Are you an idiot? He's too young to make that kind of decision. Fuck's sake, Finn. He's an old soul. He knows what's up. Hold on, please. 
You're standing near a boatload of cash. We can do this in five minutes, in and out. And then you're off to Mexico. You won't hear about me ever again. We got this, man. Trust me. No means no, Finn. Meryl is right fucking there. <gasps> He's a log. Won't even know. You asshole. I want to help, Sean. We could get out of here. Go to Mexico. If I say let's do it, that would be, well, bad because that would mean we're condoning it and I don't want to condone it. But if we say no fucking way, then I feel like Daniel's going to do it anyway and in time bad's going to happen and maybe he will learn from it and feel bad and in be less of a brat in the next episode. I don't know. Either way, I feel like some shit is going to go down and it's not going to be good. But I'm going to stick with no fucking way because... No fucking way. He said no fucking way, Sean. Please. We're done, Finn. Come on, Daniel. No, why should I? We couldn't even find you before. You were with her, right? Who gives a shit? Let's go. Now. No, I'm sick of all this. For weeks. You just hang out with her. It's all your fault. Oh, for fuck's sake, Daniel. You... What do I want? Are you crazy? The fuck are you doing here? Shit. <sighs> Knew it. Don't move. Don't shoot. What the fuck? How many are you? Just us. It's just us. All right. Move your asses over there. Now. Uh, Meryl. Uh, <laughs> boss. <laughs> I know this looks bad, but... Stop. I don't want to hear any more of your shit. So, what was your big fucking plan exactly? Work here for a time and then break into my safe? Pathetic. Who was the moron mastermind? Like I didn't know. I gave you punks work when nobody would. A place to crash for free. God damn it, Finn, I told you- Shut up! This is how you repay me? Stealing from me? Uh, no, no, it's not about you. I thought you were different, smart, but you're a real dumbass for getting a kid involved. And you're I teaching him how to steal? I tried to stop it! Thief and brother of the year. Nice. <sighs> what now? You all really fucked up. I can't just let this slide. I can't. You're young, but you can learn from mistakes. That doesn't mean your lesson's gonna be easy. Or painless. Okay. On your knees. Hands on your head. Shit, don't do this. Don't. Come on, sir. We... We could talk. I'm serious. On your knees. Now. Comply. We're gonna comply. Do what he says. Don't worry. We're on our knees, okay? Meryl? No. Finn, just do it. Don't break my balls now, kid. Daniel, you got this. Don't, Don't do it, Daniel. Move. No. Just get on your damn knees. Yeah, now. He can't do this. Don't uh, fucking move. <laughs> it's not like I want to do this. The people I deal with are worse. But if you rip me off, you rip them off. Then I pay. I have a family to look after, too. I gotta protect them first. Can't let you play me anymore. You shall. Daniel has 
has been going further and further down the rabbit hole as far as he feels he's unstoppable. However, if we do nothing, then Daniel might do something anyway, rather than feel powerless. I don't know. I, 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 I feel like it's one of those we damned if we do, if we, d we damned if we don't situations where, well, I don't know. Listen, please, boss, I know, I got greedy, I, I was high, stupid, I I'll make it up. I know, Finn, you will.
This is it, son. You're toast. End of the road. No way out this time. We got a lot of room in jail for cop murderers like you. You're alone now. Alone. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.